Good Morning Lakeland. I am Hodger. And I'm Isabel, and we'll be your anchors for today. Freshmen, sophomores, and juniors, the PSAT 9, PSAT 10, SAT, and MME test is coming in April. On April 12th, all juniors will be taking the MSTEP test in the field house. The test will be divided into AM and PM sessions. You will be called out of class to take the test. Juniors, please use your Chromebook daily to receive the updates required for the MSTEP. You will also need to bring your Chromebook fully charged to the test. Thanks. On April 13, freshmen, sophomores, and juniors will take the PSAT 9, PSAT 10 with the SAT with an SA. Freshmen are to report to the field house by 7.20. Sophomores are going to go to the gym to get, the, to get your room and the assignment. You will need to check into your room by 7.20 and please plan to get here early. Juniors go to the cafeteria to check in and get your room assignment. You will also need to be in your room by 7.20 a.m. So please plan to arrive early. On April 14th, all juniors will be taking the SAT work key in the field house. You will need to be in the field house by 7.20 a.m. Thank you. From all of us here at GML to all of you, good luck to everyone testing in the coming weeks. You've got this. Seniors, this Wednesday, March 23rd, graduate service will be here at Lakeland with the Stroop Seniors Announcement. To those who are ordered them, don't forget to pick up if you, need, if you ordered them. Thank you. Class officer pictures have been scheduled for this Wednesday, March 23rd, in six hour in A506, the leadership room. Thank you. Speaking of class officers, class office applications are now available outside the A506 for any juniors, sophomores, and freshmen to apply can become a class officers. The applications are due on April 4th, Mr. Ronaldo, or his mailbox in the main office. Thank you. Link crew leaders, don't forget to complete the March check-in this week and all link leaders, please wear your purple shirt this Wednesday in support of the purple out for Chloe Howard. Thanks. Ocon Community College is coming to Lakeland to do an site administration. They will be here on April 27th. All of you need to need your social security number and the personal email account. You can get admitted here right, right here at Lakeland. If you have any questions, please see with Mrs. Janet, and if you are interested in signing up for their visit, please scan the OCCT QR code around the building. Thank you. Students who are considering taking yearbook as a class next year must pick up an application form directly from Mr. Head this week and return it to him by this Wednesday, March 23rd. There are also a couple recommendation forms that must be shared with a teacher. Anyone not completing this process on time will automatically be removed from consideration. This year edition for a scribes Lakeland book and student writing the photography art is coming soon. We will be accepting student writing and artwork from now through March 25th. Students can submit work to LHS scribes at hvs.org. Please attach your work as needed, but please no PDFs. Students may publish anonymously. Ask at any questions, please see Mr. Trice in A307. Thank you. This Wednesday, March 23rd, Lakeland is hosting Purple Out Spirit Day in honor of Milford High School student Chloe Howard. Chloe is the member of the Milford border, border Cross team who suffered a head injury while snowboarding out wet and west. In the show of unity and in the show of all of us here, the Lakeland are thinking about her and we're hosting this Purple Spirit Day. So this Wednesday, the 23rd, please wear your purple, her favorite color, in support of Chloe. Thank you. One of many clubs here at Lakeland and National Technical Honor Society. This group, is one, this group is a student club for students who are taking career and technical classes, such as business, marketing, video production, and others. And others here at Lakeland. He, here is the, the feature for David, David, Laura, and the National Technical Honor Society. There are many clubs at Lakeland, including the National Honor Society, Another special club is the National Technical Honor Society. The National Technical Honor Society is an honor society for students interested in careers for technical fields. The National Technical Honor Society was founded in 1984 and currently has almost 1 million students in the NTHS alumni. It has been here at Lakeland for the last 10 years thanks to Mr. Scott Rolando. I asked him a couple questions about the National Technical Honor Society. Uh, the need for an NTHS club at Lakeland, I think, um, is important because it provides another outlet for 
honor students um, in the tech ed field and career field. So the video business, marketing, uh, graphic design, all that types of stuff. National Honor Society is good, it's great, it's so general. It's open up to the entire building, which is fine. But and THS is specifically for career tech ed kids, so it's nice to see some honor students in the career tech field. Um, I don't know if I expected a lot of kids to join or not. Um, it's open by, you gotta like get invited to, to be a member. So um, you gotta get nominated by a CTE teacher. So uh, I got a lot of nominations. And then this year specifically, we had a big number of kids join, which was great. Uh, so I was really happy about that to uh, increase our numbers in the club. So the requirements to join are, uh, you gotta be a good citizen. <laughs> um, you gotta have uh, like a 2.0 GPA, or I think it's a 3.0, 3.0 GPA in your CTE courses um, and have taken at least two CTE courses. So um, the requirements aren't super huge, um, but they are a little bit daunting to have a 3.0 within your CTE classes. Um, you also have to be nominated by a CTE teacher. So if you're not nominated by a CTE teacher, you don't even get the invite. So, but those are the uh, requirements to get in. So the things that we do to set us apart from the National Honor Society is we do tech ed related type stuff. Um, we do a lot of like career development type things. We go on field trips uh, to different uh, career and you know work based type of places. Um, we've done some college based field trips that are specific for um, tech ed students. Um, we will look at schools business departments, not just go look at the school in general. Go look at schools computer science departments, not just the school in general, you know what I mean? So we do those types of, of trips and field trips. We also bring in speakers and other things like that that are more tech ed, career ed related. I also took a moment to talk with the four officers at the NTHS club at Lakeland on their perspective of the club. I'm really interested in like jobs in the tech field. So I thought this was a great opportunity, especially because I've been taking a lot of CTE courses and it sounded like a lot of fun. All right, so this year we're getting into a lot more of the actual NTHS stuff. like. We're starting to plan some more field trips, like to either colleges or you know just stuff for fun that's related to tech. And we're also getting into some other college stuff, like trying to figure out where we best fit at, how we can get some more scholarships, and overall it's been pretty fun. Uh, I think anyone that's even interested should definitely join because it's not much of a time commitment. All our meetings take place during school, so there's not much after school. It's pretty fun, anyone's welcome, and there's a variety of topics we cover in the technology field. Um, I like the most that we get to experience a lot of new things, like looking at colleges and all the opportunities, and that it's not as much of a commitment since all the meetings are in class or in school, so you don't have to worry about being outside of it. If you have any questions regarding NTHS, make sure to talk to the NTHS advisor, Mr. Rolando. Students, don't forget that lunch and breakfast are still free this year for all Lakeland students. Make sure to take advantage of this offer. And now for the sports. Good luck to all of our spring sports team this spring season from all here at Good Morning Lakeland. Remember that you can find all of the latest athletic information out on the Lakeland Athletics Facebook and Twitter. Also, you can watch many of the games live through the NFHS network. Well, it's time for anchor shout outs. First up is me. I'd like to shout out Chloe Graham. And I'd like to shout out for Mr. Orlando. Don't forget, we always post our episodes of Good Morning Lakeland on the LHS website at www.hs.org slash slash LHS. You can also find us on Instagram by searching at LHS underscore gmail.com. Please give us a follow. Thank Thanks you for, for watching. watching. Good, Good morning, morning Lakeland, Lakeland, and have a great day. day.